Hi guys, FIFAN0511 here today with episode 4 of my uh, fairly new series of PPF squads where basically I take a player um, who is uh, rumoured to be leaving the club or is set to be leaving the club and um, yeah, I put them in a squad, four players they currently play with um, will be in it as well as three players they are rumoured or definitely soon to be playing with and three players that we used to play with. So today's player is a bit of an interesting one for me. I've gone for Danny Ings purely because he has played pretty well this season um, in the Premiership um, despite being at Burnley and despite them going down. But uh, yeah, he is set to leave with his contract expiring and I think he is getting to this age where he is a bit... Um, too good for Burnley, in my personal opinion. So anyway, let's go through the team then. Um, so first up is Simon Mignolet, um, Liverpool's goalkeeper, who basically Ings is rumoured with a few clubs, and I've highlighted two of them with Liverpool probably being the main one. So that's why I've gone with Mignolet in goal. Anyway, he's 82 rated um, from Belgium. Key stats: 84 diving and 84 reflexes, and he normally costs about 1,000 to 2,000 coins. And right back then we have Kieran Trippier, who does currently play with Danny Ings. Uh, 72 rated, plays for, well, obviously plays for Burnley from England. Key stats, 83 pace and 73 physical. And he costs us 1,600 coins. At right centre back is our second player he currently plays with. is Jason Shackle. 72 rated, plays for Burnley from England. Key stat 78 physical and 72 defending. And he costs us 1,200 coins. At left centre back we have Michael Duff. Burnley's captain I believe. And uh, their thir his third player he currently plays with. Uh, 67 rated uh, from Northern Ireland. Key stat 67 defending a 62 physical and he costs us 700 coins and left back we have our discard inform player of the day now Ashley Young from Man United is the second um, of the two clubs I was looking at because Ink surprisingly is rumoured with both Liverpool and Man United as a free agent just as like another backup striker I suppose um, so yeah Ashley Young then uh, he's a left back but normally he's a left mid slash left winger uh, key stats 87 pace 84 dribbling and 4 star skills he costs us 19,000 coins and if we lose our game with this team then unfortunately we will have to quick sell him at holding midfield then is the first player in this team which he used to play with now Nathaniel Chaloba I think in the last two seasons has spent uh, loans, various loan spells at Burnley I believe I know he's there for part of the season this year but I know he's also there last season at times I believe anyway uh, 68 rated uh, says here well his current version He's at Reading, but he is on loan from Chelsea, who are his parent club. Key stats, 75 pace, 70 dribbling, and 70 physical. And he costs us 2,400 coins. At right mid um, is our final player that he currently plays with, who, of course, is Ross Wallace. 69 rated from Scotland. Key stats, 78 pace, 70 dribbling, and he costs us 600 coins. Now, my second player that he used to play with is Jay Rodriguez. 75 rated, um, currently at Southampton. Uh, key stats 85 pace, uh, 76 number, 76 uh, shot, as well as 4 star weak foot. And he costs us 650 coins. And J. Rodriguez ha was at Burnley for a couple of years with Danny Ings. At attacking mid is my final player that he he could play with next season. And that is Adam Lallana, who is currently at Liverpool. 80 rated from England. Key stats 84 dribbling, 80 passing, 5 star weak foot, 4 star skills. And he costs us 1,000 coins. 1,100 coins. Finally, at left striker then, we have Charlie Austin. His final player that he used to play with. They used to form a formidable strike partnership in the championship. Um, it was pri just prior to um, when Austin joined QPR. And when which put Burnley in the shit really but somehow we still managed to come out of last season anyway as you can see Austin's key stats then 80 shooting this is gold upgrade 76 pace and 76 physical and let's focus on the man himself then Danny Ings uh, 71 rated uh, at, currently at Burnley from England key stats 89 pace 73 dribble and 70 shooting and he did cost us 2,600 coins so as always we are going to go into a match uh, play of the team and then if I win or draw then nothing happens if um, I lose, then I will have to quick sell Ashley Young in form, which is something I really do not want to do. Right, so we're coming off against a squad named Koreans. Now, if he has a team of Koreans, this could end interestingly. I think he might do. 
Yes, he does. He has a team of Koreans. This is this is very interesting, must say. He has got Human Son uh, Man of a Match as well. Uh, Bo Young Kim there. As V8 uh, Cardiff might be an unrecognisable player, really. So, uh, nevertheless, we are going to go into the game. Hopefully, we can um, win. It's the ideal thing. Just see what this team's like to play with. And hopefully, um, we don't lose enough to quick start Ashley Young. Through ball there to Son. Son's put it in, and we're 1 0 down to 7 minutes. I thought we've been. We seem to have the attacking position. That's his literally first time he's even got forward. So yeah, we are 1-0 down very early on. Lalana. Put through Ings. Oh! Good effort that is from Danny Ings. Swung back, took that well, but unfortunately it's just why. That's probably our first real clear cut chance. Rodriguez. Austin. Ball back over the top. Lalana's made good ground here. Oh, it's gone scrappy. Wait, I'm, I'm confused what's just happened. Wallace has put the ball in the net, but nothing. I think it was a foul there from the diving header. Either that or an awful offside decision. I couldn't. I just couldn't tell. Good challenge, yeah. Ball with the top to Danny Ings. Ings with a great first touch, and that's a fantastic finish. And Ings has made it 1 all. Great finish from Danny Ings. He took the first touch nicely, and the finish was sublime there. And we are back in this game. Ooh. Okay, so it's one all at half time. A very good game this has been. As you can see, he's had one shot. That's it. I've had five shots for a target and 16% more possession. I haven't just built on that. It's a nice team in Ings and Austin. It's a great little strike partnership. Austin puts through Shaloba. Shogoba and there it is 2-1 picks up Danny Ings with a low driven cross Ings the man of the episode gets his second oh nice through ball Lee Kyo Lee Kyo Kyo Ho to all one counter attack, that's all it takes. Mingele, he's had a fairly good game when needed, but just couldn't do anything about that one. That is too all. Human Son, oh, what a save that is from Mingele. Lalana, Austin, Ings, oh. Oh, you're jet, of course it's gone in. Lee Xiang Hun has put us 3 2 behind in the 90th minute. I don't know how. I don't know how. Ings straight from kickoff. Ings! Danny Ings for man of the moment has got his hat trick. I think, I think we're still getting relegated. But either way. Oh. Okay, so fish is free with me and we get relegated, but that doesn't matter because either way we're not quick selling Ashley Young in form. A hat trick from a man of the episode, uh, Danny Ings. Has, yeah, he's just kept it. Kept it alive for us. So anyway, uh, that is it for this episode. I do hope you've enjoyed. If you've got any players you'd like to do a PPF squad on, then please feel free to uh, send me a message or comment. Yeah, do whatever. Anyway, thanks for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, follow me on Twitter, check out my blogs, and I shall see you soon. Bye-bye.